Here we have another important question here. Uh, you might want to ask, what are the parts of algebra? When you look at an algebraic expression or an algebraic equation, what are the different parts? In one of my videos, I gave you information on what is algebra. It's a combination of letters, numbers, and um, arithmetic operations. Let me write an algebraic um, expression here. 3a square plus b plus 3 equals what? All right, this is an algebraic expression, equation, algebraic equation. Let A be 3 and B be uh, 2. All right, as simple as possible. What would be the different parts of this um, algebraic equation? So these are terms. So these are three terms. All right, the terms are formed between the operations. All right, so this is a term. These are the terms. 3a square b, 3. Those are the terms, all right? And there's no like term because these are different, so there's no like term. Um, this is a coefficient. A number which is in front of the verb is the coefficient. So we have the coefficient, all right? It is the number in front of the verb, which is three. Then we have this up here, which is the exponent or power, all right? Exponent, which would be a two there, all right? A to the second power. What it is saying is that you should multiply a two times by itself. That's what the exponent is saying. The exponent is indicating to you how many times you should multiply the base number by itself. I will get to that in a short while. Then we have the constant. This by itself with no variable at all is the constant, which would be equal to three. All right, and those are the basic parts of, and then we have the operations, which is, uh, that's a plus um, additional sign for our operations. Let's see if we can do this together though, before we um, end our time together. 3a, b, plus three. 3a, square plus b plus 3 equals what? All right, we say a is what? 3, okay. So we have 3 square plus, and b is what? b is going to be 2, huh? 2 plus 3 equals. Remember I said earlier that the power or exponent indicate how many times you should multiply the base number by itself. In this particular case, we have 3 square. What it is saying is that we should multiply 3 times 3, which will give us 9, right? And 3, 9 is going to give us 27 plus 2 plus 3 equals. 27 and 3 is going to equal to 30 plus 2, give us 32. And that would be the answer for our algebraic equation, right? So, pause the video or you can replay and um, learn the, about the parts. Or you could just try this one for yourself. 4 a square plus b minus 2 equals. Alright? Try this one for yourself and tell me what your answer is going to be.